Well then, it's resolved. We all love my new gavel. Now, if there's no more business to discuss, then... Ivy, that's an unusually dramatic entrance for you. Do you think you're ready to try public speaking? I... No. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, and uh, and I can do it because I washed my hands 80 times today. I know I haven't always been the dom this town deserves. I know I have a lot um, to work on and get over, but... But I've been there for you. For all of you. I mean, Billy, when your wife left you, who was there to choke you with their feet? Well, you were. And Mrs. Newton, when your house burned down, who was there to peg you in its ashes? Well, that was you. And Mr. Mayor, when you had the impulse to embezzle money from the town school board, who was there to help you exorcise those impulses through a game we called Corrupt Politician and Innocent School Board? It was you, Ivy. Thanks for that, Ivy. Anytime, Mrs. Mayor. But if you're losing clients to a business that isn't governed by neuroses, well, there's nothing any of us can do. I've got something that can help. Oh, ho, ho! classic shots all! Oh. to the mega dungeon? Because innovation and gumption still mean something in this country? And because I'm a woman who's made a life for herself in spite of and because of specific struggles. And because you love me. Because I'm the kind of person who does the things that scare her even though they scare her. So we gotta work for her now? This isn't over. You haven't heard the last of us, Chantal and Greg. Remember those names. Chantal, that's her, and Greg, that's me. Chantal and Greg! Well, I guess their names are Chantal and Greg. Good to know. Anyway, Ivy's livelihood is saved. I guess that ends the town hall meeting. What, really? That's all we had to discuss today? Yep, we're a weird town. Weird.